What is going on everyone? Maj here again and welcome back to more Pokemon Where today guys we are back with a battle video featuring um a passerby battle that I literally just did So if you guys are enjoying my battle video things be sure to drop a like down below and If you guys want to see more Battle videos or battles in general if this recording device's hard drive can handle them. Be sure to also subscribe down below. Anyway, let's get this started. So the basically the reason why this is a battle video, not another live battle, is because like I said, the the freaking hard drive cut off. So anyway, they send out they send out Espeon and I send out my Politoed. Oh, I wish I could have named that boy. So I get I get Politoed's Drizzle in, and this team mainly revolved around um, Politoed's Drizzle, but they outspeed and go for Psyshock. I live on um, just a sliver a sliver of hell, so I just try to make the most and go for Skull, and that does a crap ton of damage. Voice crack, good god. And I get the burn hacks. So I, I just switch out, like, okay, Paul, I told you, you did your job, and I send out main electric, because, you know, main electric has thunder and blah, blah, blah. The side shock, I'm like, no way, that's going to take me out again. It takes me out. It's one of those moments. I'm like, how did that even happen? But it has life orb, and, and from the burn and life orb, down goes Espeon. Then they send out Absol. And I send out my Glaceon, which is, it's done really, really well in, in past battles, so I'm just, you know what, Put, I'm just putting it in. So they swap out their Absol, and they go into my champ, thinking that, oh, it's a fine type, it's gonna destroy it. I go for Blizzard, and look, look, look. Freeze hacks! Freeze hacks, look at that. Beautiful freeze hacks. So I go for another Blizzard, taking advantage of that freeze hacks. It stays frozen. So I'm like, okay, what well, item do you have? I take its item, and it has an assault vest. And what the crap is an assault vest? I mean, seriously. Tell me in the comments, what is an assault vest? So I go for a blizzard again, and that takes out my champ. So now they send out Cloister. And I just, just thinking, what should I swap into? So, in the end, I just go into Politoed, just see what I can make out of him. So I, and also, so I can reactivate Drizzle for no apparent reason. And then they go for Shell Smash. Shell Mufasa. <laughs> Which raises their attack, but I take advantage of the defense drop. But then... They outspeed and go for Ice School Speeder, which is a move I never heard of. I want to guess it's um, Cloyster's signature move. But yeah, if that, if that hit once, it would have been amazing. So I send in Swamper, because, you know, he has Hammer Arm and all that good stuff. And I Mega Evolve Swamper since I can Mega Evolve um, my neck trick. But they outspeed and go for Ice School Spear. I'm like... Okay, please live. Please, please live. Because it's cutting down health by, like, by the ton. And I live on 15 health, and I go for hammer arm, but it misses. I'm like, oh my god, there's no way that misses. And then they wind up finishing me off with ice shards. So I send in Gigalith. Because I know this thing is an ice type, and rock is good against ice. I'm also afraid it has a water attack, but Rock Blast, and I'm like, how do they have Rock Blast? It's an Ice type. So I wind up living on from all that Rock Blast, and I go for Rock Slide, and that hits. I'm like, yes, and that takes down Cloyster to its Focus Sash, and I'm just. I rage out on that focus session. I'm like, I thought I had it. I really thought I had it. 
and the scumbag Rock Blast, Rock Blast misses, and I just finish it off with Headbutt, which is a crit, and that crit definitely mattered. Totally. But look at that, guys. 21 turns. No wonder the hard drive cut out. So I restore HP, and now they send out the blah 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 because your boy can obviously speak Japanese. Just by saying blah 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 blah. So I go to Del Fox. I'm just. And I immediately regret that because I think most Klefkis have foul play. But they wind up saying reflect up, reflect and light screen. And I'm like, why? Because I was gonna go for fire blast and just think I would take it down and go. It lives on half health. So I have a life orb on Del Fox now. So now, so they decide to switch out, and, I, and then they send in Zapdos. And I just get one more fire blast in, just cause I get, I get the burn hacks, which is amazing. So I just think what I should do. I think, I think, I think. And leftovers burn life orb. So I just I switch out Del Fox. I'm like, okay. Let me put in Glaceon, because it's going to be super effective in the end. They go for Thunder Wave, which... Glaceon is just a beast. It don't, it don't need no paralysis to stop it. That isn't... It's so bulky. I actually got this from a giveaway. I get most of my shiny Pokemon from a giveaway. When I say most, I mean all. So it goes for Heat Wave. And it, and it lives on 41 health. I'm like, how? How underleveled is this Zapdos? I go for Ice Beam. It lives on a sliver of health. It heals with leftovers. But the burn eventually takes it out. And that's Zapdos down. So now they send out their Absol. I'm like, okay, what does this Absol have? It winds up being Mega Absol. And at this point, I was thinking, what could it have? What could it have? It has Fire Blast! Boy! Boy! How does this thing have Fire Blast? I never knew Absol can learn Fire Blast. Like, I never ever did. So I sent in Google if I'm like, okay, this, this Absol is the death of me. Look at that, they outspeed Google if they go for Sucker Punch. I send in Del Fox, I'm like, okay, this is gonna be. I go for Fire Blast, hoping to outspeed. They go for Sucker Punch, they outspeed, and that is game. Let me see. Let's see. That was kind of short. You know, let me let me try to find another one. Alright, this is another one that I haven't seen in a long time. It's a double battle on Battle Spot. So they send out Gallade and um, Lucario. So I mega evolve Ampharos, because you know, Mega Ampharos is kind of my boy. Back when I used this team. Like, do Mold Breaker. I completely forget what Mold Breaker does. And go for um, Psychic. That one hit KOs Lucario. I mean, oh my god, that's crazy. And Power Punch hits on the Ampharos, and of course they get the attack boost from that. And I go for Signal Beam, because I know this thing's a second type, and it does nearly a third damage. Now they send out their Shiny Medigross. Ooh, Shiny! I have many Shiny Pokemon now. And I go for Dragon Dragon Pulse, excuse me. Dragon Pulse, and that does like 6 damage. Shadow Ball. Hits on yeah. And flash cannon. Flash cannon hits doing third damage to Lodios. My thunderbolt hits. So much things happening at once. That's the problem with narrowing these double battles. And Dragon Pulse hits there. And just a disclaimer guys, if if the camera cuts out any time during this this now it's the hard drive, as I said in the beginning. This thing's hard drive is really, really bad. So Dragon Dragon Pulse hits on Metagross, and that's Metagross down. Now they send out their Cresselia. 
and and I don't know why they didn't do this earlier, but they they mega evolve their Gallade. But I outspeed, I go for Psychic, that does another third damage, and then they have Psycho Cut, which takes out Latios. It's how they go to return, which does barely anything to me, and Signal Beam takes it to half health. Oh, and then I send in the, my Gengar, my Fat Ghost Gengar with Shadow. You have Shadow Ball, but that hits and I live. And I go for Dark Pulse, which takes out the. Okay, doesn't take out Cresselia. Then they wind up restoring all their HP with Moonlight. Well, I don't think it's all their HP, but a nice chunk of it. I go for Signal Beam. This thing is very, very powerful. And go for Shadow and the galley go for Shadow Ball and that's um Gengar down. For Sully goes for Ice Beam and then that's Ampros down. So I'm down for I'm down to one Pokemon which is Swampert. I would have actually never guessed to be honest. I completely forgot what I had at the beginning. So power of punch it hits. And the Galilee gets the attack boost. Cresselia goes for Moonlight again. And that restores, again, most of its HP. I go for Earthquake, but Cresselia has Levitate. I'm like, okay. Then that Earthquake, of course, it's gotta take out the Galade. And it's just me against Cresselia. Return, again, almost doesn't, just do nothing at all. And Surf, it has, it does barely anything, to be honest. Oh my god. The Shadow Ball. It's, they're just taking me down. It's, to, be, to be honest, it's just become a battle of who can get to zero first. Cresselia goes for Moonlight. And like, of course it's gonna go for Moonlight. They go for Surf. I'm just praying, I'm praying for a crit, but Ice Beam, it hits, and it's another hit, I guess. Surf, it's another hit. We get it down to red. Of course, we're gonna go for Moonlight, because that's what Cresselia is. Oh my god, when's this thing gonna end? We're getting close to hard drive space right here. It's basically Surf against Ice Beam and Moonlight at this point. I... You know what? It's it's uh, Cresselia wins. Cresselia wins. I bet. I bet. I bet. So if you guys have enjoyed this battle video, be sure to drop a like down below. And if you guys want to see more battles, be sure to also subscribe down below. Anyway, I'm just gonna let this battle finish up, and I'll see you all later. Bye! <laughs>